Do, do, do. Okay. Well, we are here on day two, and we're starting Bastion, the very beginning of Bastion. The future of Bastion is in our hands. <clears throat> ah, yes, the greeter. It seems this ooh, Nemnus unit has been deactivated. Anima has been so scarce of late. With no souls entering our gates, I suppose it was a prudent measure. Anima is our most precious resource, after all. There are some Centurions nearby. A portion of their mana could serve our needs. Ah, one of our most helpful stewards is here to lend her aid. It will give you, it will guide you in the collection effort. Please? Yes. Take my bell. Centurions will share. Thank you, little owl person. Take the barrel. Hold tight now. No animal must fall. Okay. Some anima for you. I'm taking anima. And some anima from you. My anima for Bastion. Have enough. We risk greeter now. Okay. It's a soft chime. Animal reserves now nominal. Initializing. How may I assist you? Welcome, worthy one. I am Greeter Nemnus. Nemesis. It is my duty and pleasure to assist you on this, your first day among the Kyrian. Allow me to congratulate you. Your fate is reserved for the most noble of souls. Only those who lived a life of service may call Bastion home. I am certain you have many questions. All new aspirants do. Please allow me the honor of introducing you to the next chapter of your existence. Cool. I'm not dead, though, really. Uh, I, I think there's a mistake. I'm not dead, lady. We understand that the end of a mortal's existence can feel abrupt and is sometimes difficult to accept. You are not the first, nor will you be the last. I'm, I'm not dead. No, I do not understand. From which world, system, entity, realm, or form of existence do you originate? I'm I'm from Azeroth, yeah. Greetings, denizen of Azeroth. We have prepared a number of activities to help you acclimate to your new existence. I'm not dead. Please visit each station to learn more. I must prepare my station. I will meet you there. Okay. <clears throat> not dead though. The station four. The bells of Bastion will calm your soul. Listen and be at peace. Can I ring the bell? The Vespers of Bastion are no ordinary instruments. Ooh. Their voices bolster the spirit and draw forth the lingering burdens of one's former life. Bells of Bastion. Ooh, there's a rare over there. Herculon. I'm going to go ahead and sidetrack here. I can't. He's like above... Can I go around? I want to fight him anyway. Herculon. Oh, wow. No, I just can't act. We'll fight you later, Herculon. Check out all these little stuff. What is this place? Welcome. Please add your name to the list of noble souls who now call Bashing Home. I don't know if I should sign this. There we All go. All deeds from your previous life will be collected and stored. The archives compile the histories of countless mortal worlds as seen through the eyes of aspirants like yourself. Okay. 
I want to make sure that I go to hers last. What do we got going on here? Welcome, new aspirants, to the first step in your journey through Bastion. While you venture among us, we will teach you the virtues of purity, courage, humility, wisdom, and loyalty. You will cleanse yourself of your mortal flaws and ascend to a higher state of being, capable of performing our most sacred and difficult tasks. Uh -huh. We have much to teach you, but have no fear. Your journey is your own, and you may walk the path at your own pace. All right. Look, I want to get into some of the action here. I know it's the intro, but... Step into the pool, friend. Okay. We got... Wash away the trauma of death. This isn't going to work. Passing through the veil can be traumatic. Allow us to cleanse the pain of that ordeal. Oh, God. That come out of me? That's gross. Carry on with your learning. You will meet me in Vakunda. Like we've never seen a dead guy have something like that before. That's, that's kind of weird. What's in all your mind? I've given you presents. I have given your presence here some thought. It is clear to me that you are no ordinary arrival from Oribos. I do not know why you are here, nor what you hope to achieve. That alone is simply unprecedented. You must understand, individuals do not merely come to Bastion on a whim. This fate is earned, and those who are chosen for it are uniquely suited to its existence. Why are you here truly? Truly! Uh, I was in the Maw, and it's kind of fucked up in there. Yep, that's right. That cannot be. That <laughs> cannot be. What is the meaning of this? I muster sense that I am able to greet us. I will handle this matter. Okay. Why is this military inactive? We can ill afford this anima expenditure. Goodbye. No! Everyone. This newcomer brings troubling news of Kyrian in the Maw. We must inform the Archon. A grim fate. But if the Arbiter judge them deserving of it, then the matter is not our concern. These were not prisoners, but willing servants. Surely this merits an audience. There is but one way to earn an audience with the Archon. Yeah. To walk the path and prove worthy of ascension. Worthy of a lot of shit. Let's go. What up? I would have you speak. You know, all these, all these, these are huge beings, very big. If you wish to stand before the Archon, there is a path you must walk. Thankfully, it is well worn and serviceable even in these dire times. Though you are not destined to become Kyrian, our ways may be of interest. Learn well, learn fast, and perhaps the Archon will take notice and grant you this audience. Brent Clay, he show you the way. Archon's eyes upon. You know the path better than most aspirants. Thank you, Sign Line. Take that. As would I. <laughs> Follow the path. As if we have. We should be on our way. How's it going, buddy? Hope you're doing all right. Wait, which way did she go? Oh, I wasn't paying attention. I had nearly passed my final trial when the drought began. None have ascended since. This place looks great. Little big man. Realm 
I could hear a good tune to you. Well, words cannot express what was lost. Wait, let me show you. What the heck is this? See Bastion through her eyes. Seek out my soul bond, Teliger, at Asteron's watch. Oh, so she can like see all the souls and stuff. Kind of neat. Um, going all right, man. It's going all right. Uh, I'm gonna be playing this quite a lot, I think. I'm excited that it's out and I get to play it. I'm very much looking forward to it. Are you, like, ever free anymore, bro? Work just kicking your ass? You know we love that mining XP. Travel to the Aspirant's Rest. Oh, uh, see, I'm distracted by these mining out nodes now. I shouldn't be. <laughs> but I gotta mine them. Give me that mining ore. White path. We have arrived. Telegers will be eager to meet you. There's more. Oh, that's like all the way up there. We're not that one. Looking for a one pel Pelagos. <clears throat> Clea, thank the Archon. Pelagos began the ritual without you. What? That fool. We have little time. Okay. We will fix this dragon. Pelagos is my soul bind. He is my brother, my closest friend, my mentor, and my student. He knows me completely, and I him. It is a bond stronger than any other. That he now struggles is a torment to me, but I am forbidden from intervening. An aspirant must succeed or fail on their own merits, or the trial is forfeit. I am bound by this law, but you are not. Please bring Pelagos back to me. This will not be his last trial, nor uh, not when he may finally have a chance. Cool. As you will soon learn, a ritual cleansing can be a painful process. In most cases, the upwelling of emotion is harmless. And even gener generate anima under the right circumstances. Ooh. However, sometimes the result is far less pleasant. Negative memories can take form their own and manifest in a violent fashion. I fear Pelagos' attempt at cleansing has brought forth such monsters. You must destroy them quickly. Pelagos may soon succumb to doubt and fear. Make haste. <laughs> Uh, well, uh, I'm sorry to hear about your work problems. Basically, what's going on right now in-game is that I got sent to another world where dead people go when they die, but I'm not dead, and I'm here because beings from this world are turned evil and are stealing people from our world who are just straight up alive. But uh, we've got to, we've got to, you know, do some random tasks for some random people. Kill some monsters and collect some apples and some bullshit, you know. I walk behind me. Uh, we're going to pull a little bit more than that. Tapping you. Let's 
Honestly, it looks like a lot, but it really isn't. Oh, this this chick is dumb. She's very dumb. Now all of these guys are mine, and she will take none of them. I've been playing this game for a long time, so I make it look easy. But, um, it's really just, these are just buttons on your keyboard. You know, one through nine at the top. That's just this. And these are all different abilities that do stuff, you know. This deals holy damage. This deals damage. This deals damage. This deals damage. They all do different things in different ways. Now we got Vaughn and Vasquez who are going to be playing. I don't know. Maybe you should have bought that computer, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know? Could have been pretty sick. Uh, oh wait, I only need to kill one more. But yeah, the new expansion dropped like two days ago, and uh, my plan really is I'm just gonna stream all of it. Oh, there's a mining node here. I must mine. I'm a jewel crafter, you know. Next year? Yeah, I mean, it's whatever, dude. Whatever you can... Whatever you can do... Help. Enough. You need me to help you, bro? Wrong. You okay? Have a good one, man. Thanks for dropping by. Appreciate it. Take the seat. Your failure is a stain on your soul. No, no, I must not give in. Don't give in, Pelagos. Don't give in. You're stronger than this. Huh. That was too close for comfort. Thank you. I feel much better now. Your voice acting is weird. Thank you. I am much better now. I want more mining nodes. Ugh. That was reckless, Pelagos. You would have fallen if not for that mortal. True. I thought I could succeed on my own, but I was wrong. Pelagos, you can't do shit, buddy. Have you read anything interesting lately? Oh, he's giving me pants. Oh, and they upgraded to blue? 98! And it's crit mastery. Actually, you know what? Let me check mastery. Did it change? Increases a healing done by up to 35.30% based on the proximity of your target. So it hasn't changed. Still the same. I've given Calstein's words some thought. If you were to learn our ways, we should proceed as if you were an aspirant yourself. The next step is to journey through the Aspirant's Crucible. It is a place of reflection, training, and cleansing. For an Aspirant, it is where they prepare for the long journey ahead. For you, I hope you will learn how you might help us in this time of crisis. Word of your arrival has likely spread. We will not keep them waiting. 
Take my steed and go in service. Go on ahead. Pelagos and I will make our way over on foot. Uh, must we walk? I am fairly fatigued after my trial. Consider Maybe you should. Part of your training, my friend. Maybe you shouldn't be such a punk buster going in there by yourself, brother. Come on now. I welcome you. The old way. You there? Might I ask your help? I must confess, with the lack of new souls arriving, our supplies have dwindled. We lack the means to clothe the rivals in proper curing attire. Before. The <clears throat> Before the foraging of the Centurions, Aspirin's trained against the native wildlife. Perhaps there's another way that these beasts can prove useful. If you collect materials from the Cloud Striders and the Larions nearby, you can use them to ensure our new arrivals look the part. Oh, and some thread from Marine, if you would. Okay. Walk with courage. Keep your eyes on the sky. Spend their lives airborne. But we don't want to leave just yet. I hope something I have will be of use. What do you have? Do I need thread? Oh. Return soon. There is much more to. And then we just gotta kill uh, some stuff. What the heck kind of a beast is this? Well, too bad I have to kill it. Oh boy, they're not a hundred percent drop rate. Of course not. <laughs> what the thing? Arions? Everything just dead around here? Ooh, I'm about to make a mess. So, are the Larions somewhere else then? Dude, this shield of the Righteous does it no damage as holy. At all. Um, hello, what did I just get? I got bracers that are better than what I had. Take some haste mastery. Yup. <laughs> There's what I'm looking for. You can get up there though. These like raised areas are weird. get up here easily these guys better drop like four at a time okay he dropped five I'm down with that oops I miss it on that uh the mining node nearby. Nice. 
nine. I can't get over the way this zone looks, man. Right below. Come on. I don't know the fourth war. How do you get that title? Hey, all right. We can go turn this back in. And then get on that horse and uh, go wherever we're going. Oh, it even separates them out. That's actually kind of nice. I didn't even realize that. I wonder if it did that in Battle for Azeroth. Here you go. Oh, we replaced the heart of Azeroth. Thank fuck. And I got an upgrade from a quest about some linen. The materials you supplied were more than sufficient for my purposes. For that, you have my gratitude. I think I know how to make the best use of the excess. A dear friend of mine recently achieved the role of Acolyte in the service of the Temple of Purity. You are new here, so I will spare you the details, but it is an honor to serve a temple before one reaches ascension. I want you to celebrate her success with a gift. Will you take this parcel to Acolyte Am uh, Amathina? Amalthina. Amalthina. <sighs> Upgraded necklace. See, the thing is, is I don't know where this horse is going to take me when I jump on it. And I don't want to, like, you know, accidentally pass up these side quests. I'm going to do every single quest in this expansion. That's what I want to do. And I think that's going to be the plan, is that I'm just going to do my best to do everything. I've only done it legitimately in a few expansions where I did absolutely everything. And this is one of them that I want to do with him. What the fuck is going on here? There's bad guys running through this big gate. Kill him. Uh, here's a gift. She opens the parcel. A soft smile spreads over her face. This is wonderful. Thank you. You have no idea what you just delivered, do you? She opens the parcel to reveal a wreath of Larion plumage. I will explain, but first, I wish to return the favor. Cleister and I frequent a resting place to the north of here, along the path to the Temple of Courage. We planted a flower for our enjoyment, and we spend so much of our free time there. Bring me this bloom, if you would be so kind. Then I will tell you about the significance of this gift. Okay. I'm down for some flower grabbing, I guess. Uh, excuse me, what? Something tells me that this is going to take me to here. Can I actually just read the quest? What does it say? Ride it to the Crucible. I guess the Crucible could really be anywhere, huh? It could be here, it could be over there. Well, I'm doing the side quests. And you can't stop me. I do have access to the Shadowlands dungeon. Maybe I do it. Maybe. 
what's it called? The Necrotic Wake. For level 50 ones. Oh, wait, there was a quest there. Blind. I'm looking at other stuff. That doesn't appear on the big map. That ain't good. Hello there. Do you have a moment to help with my friend Zo Zosim down the hill? Sure. I got time. I ain't do nothing. Please excuse me for not standing. I would rather not disturb these creatures. Uh, okay. If you have a desire to help the creatures of Bastion, Zosim needs aid to regain control of our garden. You'll find her just down this path. Go in service. You got it. <gasps> Look at this guy. Look at this big weird owl lion bird thing. Always oh, yawn and big yawn. That better be a mount that I can get. As part of my trials as an aspirant, maintaining this garden is my first posting. Could be going better. Many of the animals here have been driven to a frenzy due to the anima drought. Okay. I am here to lend a hand, that's right. What can I do for you? This anima drought isn't hard on the Kyrian. The wildlife isn't hard just on the Kyrian. The wildlife of Bastion are suffering too. Many creatures are becoming aggressive and menacing. Worms and cloud cloud feathers. Especially, they are hurting the other wildlife and long beyond saving. If someone doesn't clear this garden of these starved creatures, we can no longer meditate here. And if we can no longer meditate, that will make the animal shortage even worse. Oh, I'm just putting these animals out of their misery? When the animals became aggravated, we left in a hurry. However, all of Kala's toys, your, your pet here, <laughs> are still inside the garden. Since you're going to be there, would you please collect them? I may be very large, but she's still young. She can be a bit of a troublemaker as well. Hopefully the return of her toys will keep her distracted. Yeah. Uh, I got you. I'm just going to do huge pull. Take these guys out quick. And see ya. Slobber ball. Gross. This one was actually enjoying its time with this comfort, comfy comfort pillow. Um, excuse you, busy. Killing another guy. And cooldowns. Give me the pillow. Mm, if I can climb up here. Oh, I'm, oh, there's two up here. I am more interested in the mining than I am in the questing at this point. So I wonder if uh, some of the same rules still apply when it comes to... Uh, Jewel crafting and whatnot. What the heck is that? Gathered by players with the mining skill. It can be bought and sold in the auction house. So is this just for that? Hold on a minute. Uh, where's my jewel crafting? Prospecting. Search five ore of base metal for precious gems. Ooh, I can. Oh, damn. Okay. How much is that? 
Well, it doesn't matter how much it is. I'm going to use it in jewel crafting. Oh, that'll hurt. I'll die if I jump that. We're going down. Somebody's skinning. It's only four more creatures. What are you playing with? Mr. Mika Nikos. A little teddy bear friend, excuse me. There's so many deposits of ore around here. Right, we're just going to kill these guys off quick. Easy. No, oh, dang it. Fine, I still got the buffs. And dead. <clears throat> Alright, I've killed the animals and I got the stuff for you for your dog. Dollar duties, yup. Yes, I gathered all of the plaything. Brought your favorite things. Oh, he loves it. I'm still new and haven't passed all of my aspirant tests, but I have an idea. There's an artifact called Corona's Allying Crook. Corona was a powerful ascended who tamed the creatures of Bastion eons ago. Her staff has the power to prevent more creatures from succumbing to savage, anima-starved state. However, the artifact is protected and only one with great courage can retrieve it. I bet you could. Go on ahead. The staff is in the reliquary to the north. I'll join you there shortly. When you get in there, ring the Vesper, the bell. Hopefully Corinna will appear and tell us what to do next. You go ahead. I need to calm Kala down. Now she's too excited because she has her playthings. Yeah, what are you going to do? Animals, right? Okay, then. Warlock coming out. Level 53. What are these level 54s doing in here? Ding ding. What must we do? No voice acting. Channel all of your anima into the staff, child. This is a test of your courage and hope. Okay, I can do this, but it could attract many of the remaining anima starved out there. Prepare yourself. When you find success within, I will return. Oh my god, no. You will not hurt my friend! I don't understand how this is supposed to be of courage when, you know, there's not much that she can do if she's all by herself trying to open up this barrier around the staff. But, whatever, I guess. This guy's got some HP on him. Stunned? Oh, 
Allah's here. And Kala grabbed the staff and left. Kala, you silly bitch, get back here. Oh. We walk this path together. I told you she could be quite the troublemaker. Oh, Kala, Jesus. Heavens, Kala has flown off with Corinna's allying crook. I saw her fly into her den to the west. Must warn you, she can become very protective when she's in there. Please be careful, but do not be afraid to give her some tough love. She's exceptionally resilient. Here, take her slobber ball. It's her favorite, and it may help to distract her. And I get some sick gloves. Whoa. Hmm. I don't want to fight any of you guys. Just let me go to the giant beast. So she gave me the ball. Wait, did she actually? Oh, there it is. Stunning her for five seconds. I didn't have all my cooldowns, so this is going to take a little bit. Just things like deflecting moves. <laughs> Man, me and this Death Knight are just not doing much of anything. Man, we got the stick. Stick acquired. Stop attacking me, please. I just want to get back to Gala. No. Yes. All right, we got the crook back. What knowledge do you bear? I have the crook. With the Crook and Corinna's guidance, I can begin to bring this place and its creatures back to their former state of respite. Thank you. Hey, well done. Your service to this place and these animals is commendable. In the years to come, I will guide you in the use of the staff to restore the garden and its creatures. Zosimi. Thank you, Great One. Humble me. Now, Kala, you were very naughty today. Oh. Go in service. See you. I got new gloves. Crit verse. Oh, that's right. I have to go get the wind blossom. I, to, I completely forgot. Make sure I keep an eye on the mini map because I'm going to miss out on quests if I don't pay attention to it while I'm running around. And that's no good. All these people on their mounts that I've never seen before. I went through a whole expansion with having not seen anything from it. And sure shit, we got a quest. Just some randos here. I just want to start the five rights. Look at this guy. 
Juice is good for thinking, good for sparring. You want I get juice? This place will no, you just keep playing your music, pal. He's having a good time. Fine journey. Aspirin's new and ancient. Take note. The herald the heralded Agatha's repose calls. Make the ceremonial journey and learn about the ancient fallen paragon who saved this very realm. Find the repose just a short ride southwest of Hero's Rest. Speak with the keeper the Nemesis in the repose. Uh I still haven't uh oh it's literally right here. Cool. There's mining to be done. And I don't think I can get up here. I've just got a mine. Please don't pull. I'm pulling that one, that's for sure. This is a different deposit, I think. We got some goodies out of that one. Cool. <sighs> Fine journey indeed. This looks uh, fucked up, to say the least. What happened here? What knowledge do you seek? What brings you to these humble grounds? Uh, I read a note and it told me about this place. Please talk to me. Greetings, mortal. Are you here to learn about the legacy of Agatha, Paragon of Courage? I welcome you to walk the grounds of this ancient battleground and learn of the battle that occurred here, and the heroic Paragon who saved all of Bastion in the Shadowlands. Read the Scrolls of Remembrance. I think there was a paragon of courage many eons ago. Take your time exploring the gar Yeah, 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 okay. Ooh, battleground. Destroyed things. Look at this giant anima robot. Eons ago, powers of the void launched... Oh, Jesus! Uh, eons ago, the powers of the Void launched a massive attack against the Shadowlands, trying to shift the balance of the cosmos. The attack blindsided the Kyrian and embraced, embroiled all of Bastion into chaos. That's not very good. Big Centurions had terrible upkeep, only used in times of war. Yeah. True. The Void could have destroyed all of Bastion, all of the Shadowland. The Void was pretty fucked up, huh? Across all of Bastion, Centurions and Kyrian alike launched into battle. Ascended fell from the sky. Oh. Oh dear, sad ascended. Mf. Self and assist fate. Service. Paragon of Courage at the time, Agatha. Agthea took charge of the forces at this very site. Bastion was on the path to surely fall, but she would not let that happen. Am I being attacked by a giant tentacle? Tisk tisk tisk. Giant tentacles ain't got shit on your boy. I welcome you. Bye, Agthea. See you later. I, I liked learning about your history, even though it's you know. I'm sure it'll come up sometime in later in the future. How may I 
It is an eternal tug of war between cosmic forces of existence. They constantly vie for power over each other, but if one fell, all words would fall into chaos. Now that you have familiarized yourself with the events leading to the battle that took place here eons ago, it's time to experience it for yourself. I fucking knew it. Ring a bell, take a deep breath, and walk in her steps. Ring the Vesper of History. The legacy of Agathia is one to be experienced. When you're ready, ring the Vesper to my right. Ding, ding. Hello, Agathia. These void invaders are wiping our forces from existence. My disciples fall, returning their anima to the lands. If we fail to drive them from our lands, more than Kyrian will be lost. First Bastion, then the Shadowlands as a whole. Oh god. Our forces of the void are infinite. They travel through the great beyond by creating portals, twisting gateways between our planes. Quickly, move close to the portals, cripple the swell of their forces for as long as we can hold. And one more quest. It's always three. Or not. Uh, I wanted to t pick that quest up. But now I'm in combat. Please go away so I can turn and talk to quest giver? Well, whatever. Maybe it wasn't even a real third quest. But it also feels like there should be a third one, so... It's not. Maybe it was just a strange glitch. Or maybe not. I knew it. Give me the quest. Uh, I see your peers fall in pain, their wounds from the void overtaking them. We cannot allow ourselves or each other to give up hope. Share your anima. Courage, steal your um, accept. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, I can't wait to go to bed. Ooh, I am tired. I'm going to try to at least hit level 52 before stopping for tonight. And then I'm waking up tomorrow morning bright and early, and we're going again. Yeah. Hopefully early enough to see some of the boys on. fight two more you let me close this portal and then maybe I'll fight you guys let me also heal this guy and then maybe I'll fight you guys all right never mind fine I'll just take you out myself Along with the help of my uh, two Agathian defenders. Thank you for the assists. You do a great service for me, and I appreciate it. The Shadowlands as a whole, that's right. We fight for the Shadowlands as a whole. There's one more portal, and it's just over there. Guess I have to kill four more baddies. 
Those three are tapped. That's a big one. It's an elite. I don't think we fight that. I don't think we fight that. Yes, I do. Come on. You speak. Yes, mortal. I welcome you. Whoa. Speak, mortal. I welcome you. I welcome you. Um, hmm. What is... Well, well, let's go back to this Agthea. Because clearly there's two for a very particular reason. Still need two guys to fight, though. Wait, I can just kill these dudes. So nice, quick little kills. Not a lot of work to be done on them. How have I not been looting some of these other guys? I rode Icker. You stand before Our the ascendancy. Duty is true. Yep. Our Dang, you really get a lot of gold for these fucking quests, huh? Despite our effort- oh, I'm about to level up! What the heck? Despite our efforts, the Void stands strong. All the forces of Bastion fight and fall one by one. The Void cannot destroy us. They are led by Tezulat, the Annihilator. Scourge of a Thousand Realms. What a name. <laughs> this day, he falls. And we get a trinket. Wow. Trinket. Excuse me, what? What are my trinkets? Oh. Oh, God. I've got some fucking dog-ass trinket. Well, I mean, it makes sense. I never had anything good anyway. I never played Battle for Azeroth, so everything I got was just kind of, uh... You know. All these huge dudes fighting one another out. Oh, okay. Turn it back. Hello, I'm here. This Agthea has one HP. Uh-oh, that's not good. Let's let it rip. I've rooted my ass, bitch. That's not good. We cannot allow the forces of the Void to continue their onslaught in Bastion. It's only a matter of time before forces falter. I cannot allow more Kyrian lives to be lost to this foe. I must use everything at my disposal to push them back before it is too late. I give all I am so that Bastion prevails. Agthea, <laughs> please. Oh, please, Agthea, please, no. Oh, well. Fight the battle. It's like I was really there. Hello. What knowledge do you seek? I exist to Throughout her life, Agathia wielded great command over the powers of Anima. With her final breaths, she sacrificed all that she had, channeling the power within and around her to turn herself into a blast. Pure anima. With a single blast, she sent out ripples that destroyed not only their commander, well, but all the void forces in Bastion. Existence maintains order thanks to her noble sacrifice. We maintain a sight of this battle in her memory so that we may learn from her courage for eternity. Very epic. Very sick. Oh, I see it. Give me that ore. I need this deposit. Very good. Oh, wait. I have seven of these. Hold on. There are no gems in this. 
that face. Um, let me check on like quest line. Right? So Bastion is seven chapters. Um, but I'm also getting like quest achievements here. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Quests, quests, Shadowlands. Complete the Bastion storylines. Seven. Complete all the optional Bastion storylines. There's 12 storylines in each one. Look, we got a lot of work to do and a lot of time to do all of it, so I'm in no rush. I want to enjoy myself and I'm having a good time playing through this stuff. Tell me your it's been a long time since I've had fun playing this game, so. I got the flower and I have hit level 52 and I learned concentration aura, a new aura. A wreath, when given by someone you cherish, is a symbolic gift. She's talking really fast. She's asked me to become her soul bind. Aww. I will take my reply. Hold on. I will take my reply to her directly. Thank you for this. I am certain you can appreciate how significant this moment is. <gasps> oh. I got concentration aura. Interrupting science effects on the party and raid members within 40 yards are 30% shorter. That's pretty epic. What the fuck does this do? Aura Mastery. Empowers your chosen aura for 8 seconds. So if I pop this, then aura mount speed goes up to 60. Damage is increased to damage reduction increased to 15% up from 3. Uh, affected allies are immune to interrupts and silences. Busted. Increases your avenging wrath duration by 50%. All that shit sucks. Is there going to be like a little thing going on here? Ask about her. Yes. She said yes. Hey, she said yes. Wait, wait, wait. Very good. You love to see it. Uh, I think that we're done. We only played for an hour today. Uh... Yeah, I streamed for about an hour. Exactly an hour. And we leveled up one time. 51 to 52. It's only 7. I really could be playing for longer, but honestly, I'm I'm tired. I'm a tired boy. And uh, I need to lay down. The route is over. Wait, what? Oh, everybody's like gathering. I don't know if the drought's over, but... Uh, we are definitely done here for tonight. Uh, and we're going to pick up tomorrow morning. Oh. Uh, I would love for you to look at me, but it's not not right now. We got to go. Um. So, yeah. I'll, uh, I'll be back on in a few hours. And by few, I mean about 10 hours. I'll be back on in about 10 hours. Bye-bye.